Hi student, in this problem we are going to find out the center alpha beta of a given ellipse and then we need to find the value of alpha plus beta. So let us go ahead and solve the problem. To solve this particular problem, let us go ahead and assume uh, that caps x, so we will assume that let caps x is equal to small x plus small y minus 3 and we consider that caps y is equal to x minus y plus 1. So therefore, the equation of the ellipse, so we can write the ellipse reduces to, so takes a very new form which is uh, well known to us. What's that? So reduces to uh, x square, caps x square obviously, divided by 9 minus plus caps y square divided by 16 and that definitely is equal to 1. Now we know that the center of this kind of ellipse is 0, 0, right? So, so center will be coordinate wise 0 comma 0 but in caps x y plane but we need to calculate the center in small x y plane so that's why we consider that cap 6 is equal to 0 that means that x plus y minus 3 and that's equal to 0 and caps y is equal to 0 which is x minus y plus 1 that's equal to 0 and given that alpha beta is the center in x y plane so alpha beta be the point of intersection of the line 1 and 2 we just rename the above two equation x equal to 0 and y equal to 0 by 1 and 2 now notice that if we add them together right so if we add 1 and 2 respectively we can say that y get cancelled so 2x minus 2 that's equal to 0 which definitely imply that x is equal to 1 and if i substitute right so if i substitute x is equal to 1 in the equation number 1. So, therefore, you can say that 1 plus y minus 3 that is equal to 0 which definitely imply that y is equal to 2 here. So, therefore, obviously as alpha beta is the point of intersection alpha must be 1 and beta must be 2 and that is it. So, therefore, alpha plus beta definitely equal to plus 3 and that is why for this particular problem option A is the correct answer. That is it. So, let us go ahead and solve the second problem. 